the fire incidents yesterday where one dormitory was lost to the fire and 80 students lost their properties completely. Uh, the board has sat down and because of the nature of the uh, loss that was there, uh, the board decided that the students go home and come back next week on Monday because uh, eight, uh, over 80 students lost their properties completely and we might not have mitigation for them, they have to go home and get the uh, required prop uh, uh, properties so that they can come back for studies. We have talked to the students and they have just gone home to make good of what uh, is there and we hope the peace shall prevail. We are very sad here as a family of Bungoma because last year alone we had more than 46 in seasons having fire and destructions. So we are praying this time, this will not be the beginning of the problem of uh, our Bungoma County. And we talk to, we are urging our parents, please talk to your children, so that when they come to the school, they will be peaceful, and the government will not rest until we get those who started the fire. For now, let us pray for peace, and we, all the parents, all the students will be going home and will be coming back by Monday next week. Just wanted to report that we have had uh, an incidence of fire where we have lost one of our dormitories. Uh, we have no details, but all our children are safe. Uh, this happened uh, when the students were in prep and they were just about to complete their prep. But the children are very safe. Th that dormitory has 88 students and they lost all their property. Yeah, we, we are appealing to them to come and support us. We have no single space within the school where we can place these young people. Kitendo cha wanafunzi wa Bokoli kama kiongozi nataka kusi wazazi ka na watoto wenu vizuri na muelegeze Kuchoma bweni si suluhisho. Iyo ni asara ambayo hao watoto wameleta. Tuko katika halimbaya ya uchumi. Tunataka tukitafuta hela tufanye mambo mengine. Now some disgruntled students have burned down the dormitory. We cannot forgive them. And I want to ask the board of Bokoli Boys High School to make sure that the culprits should not be spared in any way. Wawekwe ndani na maisha yao ishie hapo. They will not see another class anywhere because you do not deserve. Hatutalea majangili katika mashule zetu because that is only an act of arsonists. People who do not value property and life. I want to ask the DCI to make sure that the culprits who have burned down the dormitory must be brought to book. And those found should never see another gate of another school. Because they must be deterred and we cannot allow them to go and cause mayhem elsewhere.